You could move small plants, you could move yard waste. There are cars on the road. It's like it's about 9.15, but it's actually 11.49. We're going to Sears. They have some good deals. The real reason is because it's funny. Yeah, it's funny. There's some thinness in the inventory if you walk through Sears, especially in the electronics, where there's just like, there's no products on this aisle. Look at all the people at the mall. This is gonna be a big affair here. Oh my goodness, there's a big line to something. Is it David's Bridal? No. It leads into the actual mall. This is not what I signed up for. God oh, no. no. We can line up at Sears. Wait, they, they, they even got caution tape. What y'all doing? Yeah. What's the big gadget? What's the big sale? Meanwhile, <laughs> found it. There's a small line for Sears. Got a few people uh, waiting in the cars, but there's really no reason well, to hold your spot in this line. So most uh, stores now are opening 6 p.m. Thanksgiving day. However, in Massachusetts, Rhode Island, and in Maine, you cannot open at 6 p.m. on Thanksgiving Day. You have to wait until midnight to open. In most places in the U.S., you can't even experience a midnight opening anymore. Only two days get this set of rules in three states, and that's Christmas Day and Thanksgiving Day. There is, in the Massachusetts general law, about 70 businesses, business types that can be open. Look at the, the mall traffic. It's 11.50 p.m. Do you think this is Sears' last stand? No, Sears isn't going anywhere. Everybody who was waiting in their cars decided the threshold was crossed and they needed to get in line. There's a, an item in particular I'm looking for. It's a tool set. It's on good sale. I had the opportunity to order it online and pick it up tonight, and I didn't do it because I thought there won't be enough demand. Now I'm concerned. John and I are competing for an item, the Pyrex. Mm -hmm. Glass food storage set. Yep, I've got a, a $7 plastic set I've been using from Ikea and they've gotten pretty funky. Some of them smell like tomato sauce permanently. <laughs> they're, they're, they're discolored. I have a similar yeah. situation. Keep in mind, this price is only about $2 better than the best price I've seen for this item. So it's not a tremendous discount. For a limited quantity, more doorbuster item needs to make a line at the merchandise. Is that us? No. The items that I'm looking for are not limited quantity. Those items in the flyer say average of two per store. I do, I am enjoying the environment, and that's what they, they you come out for the environment now, right? It's a spectator sport. Some kind of exodus, John. Maybe, they, maybe the reason the Sears line is so long is they thought it was the mall proper line. I, for some reason, thought the mall wouldn't even open. We may have to take a walk through the mall. Sleigh bells ring. There is Christmas music. Just a little bit. The Yankee Candle is hopping. It looks like the huge line is Victoria's Secret. Yep. Lady after lady. Look at this. It continues. I think it's all for Victoria. What is going on in there? Certain number of people. Vicky's big secret. They're gonna have to count them off. And then JCPenney's got a little bit of action. What kinds of things are bringing people to JCPenney and Victoria's Secret, but not Aeropostel and Crazy A? Look, they have the entire store up to 75% off. Who wouldn't want to go to Crazy A? I don't even know what Crazy A sells. <laughs> there have never been that many customers in an FYE ever. No, it's true, because their prices suck. They're actually buying CDs. Actually buying things at FYE. 50% off your whole purchase at Gap. Gap has nice clothes. Unfortunately, nothing for my portly size. I don't know what they're giving away of Victoria's Secret, but they got the business. I don't know what the secret is. It's hers to keep. It kind of makes you want things less, doesn't it? Yeah. It makes me want to not buy anything. Wow. A lot of the young set. Young people. Yeah. They want those boots they can put over the leggings so they can look like everybody else. What's the big deal? What's the big deal? There's people already in there. They're population controlling it. That's what this is. It's probably a fire code thing. They can't allow more than a certain number of people in the building. So when somebody leaves, they can let another person in. This fragrance filled tote. Nine piece set, $25. That's a good buy. I have too many candles already. Is it disproportionately women to men? I think so. 17 to 23 women. You got your fuzz. That continues to be the line for Sears. After the, the mayhem we just walked through. <laughs> That's a representation of Sears business percentage compared to most places. They did another pass telling people that if they wanted something limited, they had to go to the merchandise pickup entrance and we lost half the line there. I'm on their website. I could order the items I want right now and pick them up. And would the deals apply? Yeah. It's on sale right there. Christmas tree, Christmas tree. A little bit of activity here in Sears. Is that the one? That's the one. I need a cart. All right. This is actually a really good deal. It's a bit and drill set. 
$12.49, normally $29.99. I think I'm gonna pick it up. So maybe uh, Sears wasn't the laughing stock we all thought it would be? Look, I knew there were good deals here. It warms my heart a little to see a Sears this flowing with customers. Doing so well. Look at this thing. That's a great price. Christmas decorations are 40% off. Um, you know, it's Christmas season now. You gotta check it out. This tree is a magic tree. You can change it. And it actually looks not like crappy LEDs. It looks like real Christmas lights. It's new innovation, Frankie. Today, it's half off. $249. 249. Some serious technology there. Craftsman themed ornaments. It's kind of cute. No one in the Christmas department at all. Just us. I do need a Christmas skirt. These have been triple reduced. I think you'd look really good in a Christmas skirt. This is the better ornaments department. They're kind of cute. Some Christmas hooks. Christmas hooks. They're not on sale, but I need them anyway. I want to browse and mosey through the electronics. Nothing excites me more than a completely unstocked electronics department. Alan used to tell me he would always come here to buy his video games because no one came to buy them, so they'd always have the newest title in stock even if they were sold out everywhere else. Right. Is there anything worse in the world than a universal remote? I'd rather have 10 than one of those. 25 foot Cat 5E cable is uh, $10 off. Yeah, it's 15 bucks. I could I could buy that on the open market for about three fifty. Thirty two gig memory card for nine bucks, and this is UHS one, so this could be used for HD video. So it's not a bad price. Save twenty dollars, save twenty one dollars. A Cumberland Farms level selection of standard def DVDs. <laughs> Only the oldest person would fall for this shit. Seventeen movies. I, I don't recognize any of those films. There's some kind of TV purchase going down. They're negotiating in herds. They, they do, do negotiate it hurts. A lot of TVs, not that great a price. They're okay. I love a good TV deal. Yeah, but we already own all our TVs. That's right. We don't need any new TVs. What are really good appliance deals at Black Friday? But that's not something one would normally, you know, come out for. This starts at 6 p.m. because all of their promo stuff is made for the other store. So I'm sure there's probably, the hours are probably a little different around here. Even the local flyer has the, the, says that they open at 6 p.m., which clearly they do. There aren't many places that sell appliances anymore. It's I know. Best Maybe the one thing this place can still do. <laughs> Ultra Plus is on sale. Seven bucks off. 20 bucks for a, for a year or more's worth of, uh, of laundry. Not good for your clothes that roughs up your fabric. That's how it gets softer. Don't do it, they're not gonna last as long. I do it anyway, I like some soft fabric. I want a new, um, a new gas stove but I don't have gas service in my house yet, so buying a gas stove would be pointless. It's fun to look at, right? You getting gas stove envy? I am. It would be so much quicker than cooking Mac on, on my electric stove. Center burner. Oh, you could make pancakes. Someday, Frankie, someday. Got a dream. Someday I'll have gas. That sounds like a serious problem. The promo is not working. So cute. That is one of your company's printers? It's a little QL320 plus. It's old. Nina, what do you got? So I've considered buying a wheelbarrow for a long time now, but it seems cumbersome and unnecessary, and my projects really aren't that intensive. But this, I can get my head around this. You could move small plants, you could move yard waste. I'm gonna lose, I'm gonna <laughs> lose some rocks. Plus, uh, we could cart each other around it. I can come in and store myself in yeah, for the winter. That could be fun. Yeah. Hey, we haven't even checked out the appliances or towel section yet. There's a whole boring store ahead of us, though. <laughs> Can you buy pool cues, Frankie? That's what I want to know. Whoa, kind of nice, but I have a phone. How much? Six bucks. I'm gonna grab one of those 32 gig, nine dollars. I'm, I'm oh, definitely. Well, you better go get one. It could be gone soon. A classic pillow, a dollar ninety nine. You cannot get a pillow that's cheaper than that. It's about as basic as a pillow gets. Two bucks though. I bought the last two of the 32 gig yep. uh, SD cards for nine dollars each. They're sold out now because of me. I picked up something while you were away too, this little digital multimeter for $9. We just put flannel sheets on our bed and I yeah. love them. Really? They're too warm for me, even in the even in the height of winter. Well, we don't pull them over us. Oh. That we lay on top of them. I see. Want a nice coarse pillow? Festive pillows. I love a festive pillow, but these are not quite my, my style. Not the word cloud. <laughs> That's Christmas word cloud. Or like this one. Don't get your tinsel in a tangle. You have a little throw pillow in your living room, and people have asked what it says on it. It says, uh, never go fishing with a notary public. I bought it at Building 19. It's, uh, it's you know, one of my, it's actually one of my prized possessions. Look, they have great deals on mattresses. Nobody. 
Midnight at Sears doesn't seem like the time to buy a bed. But don't they say that people don't really shop for other people anymore on Black Friday? Frankie, they always put mixers on sale. They're always the same price every year. It's not that much of a discount. Just don't buy them. You don't need to buy me a mixer. I have a little hand mixer for the four things I make a year that need it. It's fine. I saw this somewhere else and I was kind of intrigued. I don't think it's normally 39. I think it's normally 29. Frankie, do you have a toaster oven at your house? No, just a toaster. They are an incredible convenience. You can warm up chicken nuggets, for example, in a toaster oven. I have to have to start up the onion, the onion, the oven. Yeah, I don't want to have to start up the onion. No. You know how long that takes to boot? A good 38 minutes. <laughs> Not a Pyrex in sight? No. All this traffic in Sears, John, when did they all make their way in? Did lots of them enter from the mall? I think so. I think seeing that it was open, they thought, ah, oh, Sears has products. That's the whole idea behind a mall, is, you know, you go for one store, and then you see another store is there, and you're like, oh. The rising tide lifts all boats. But I still <laughs> want to find the pirate. Yeah. They've been code 2 all night, and I have no idea what a code 2 is. They just is. said code 2 to women's cash wraps over in the women's section. Something's going down. You need a very large Whitman sampler. It's two pounds, four ounces of chocolate oh. for 20 bucks. There's no pie rice down here. I kind of feel like to. Should we ask a sales associate? No Pyrex? No Pyrex. Not in stock. The blackest Friday. That's it, right? I've got this uh, Craftsman tool set, 108 piece, $50. Multimeter, $9. It's $59. $1 pack of Christmas ornament hook hangers, it's $60. $12.99 for this set, $72. <laughs> yeah. Plus tax. And Nina, you've got your Scoopy scoop and you got my two cards. Yeah, 20, $23 for the Scoopy scoop. $41. The line situation is just dire. It's dire for you. There's still quite a few of these left and it's such a good deal. I'm contemplating a last minute switch. I see they have another similar tool set here. It's $40 more, but it has a lot more tool diversity. It's also a very good deal. I think I might swap it. Doing it. It's doing. It's doing. Making your total purchase price $112. They're processing the other side of this line as well. Uh-oh. Double Q. Half the speed. What time is it? It's 1.13 and the AM. And look, the crowds are still rampaging. This line is yeah. fraught with peril. You picked it. Sure. Yep. The Sears card? Uh, nope. Due to the Sears My Way discount, this is going to cost zero dollars. It must be from all the money I've spent over in the auto, because I always get my car repaired at the Sears Auto, and that must go into my My Way account. And thus, this entire transaction is free. John is positively baffled. I'm still in awe that I paid zero dollars. So what happened was, long ago, you must have signed up for a My Way account. Yeah. Then you must have spent several thousand dollars in their automotive area. And I probably signed up. 2007, and I still have $12 worth of transaction points left. As long as you're willing to spend thousands of dollars on your car and wait eight years, you can reap. It was a pretty good job of experience, except for the checkout. Well, the checkout like, sucked. I'm still in awe. I'll be in awe until next year about this deal. I'll remember it forever. The, the day I was prepared to spend $112 at Sears, and I spent zero and walked out with all the stuff. I wouldn't buy this for my, for my young daughter. Why not? They set unrealistic expectations of your month to high. They said rinse the whole thing out. Yeah, because you said run water down the neck so it comes out between the legs. So down the neck and through the ass. 